When the president was told on May 17th that this whole process of the special investigation would be started with the appointment of Robert Mueller, I'm going to read from a portion of the report that describes that moment in the Oval Office. It says, when the president was told a special counsel had been appointed, the president slumped back in his chair and said, oh my God, this is terrible. This is the end of my presidency. I am, and then he used a form of a word that begins with F. I am effed. The president became angry and lambasted the attorney general for his decision to recuse from the investigation, saying to Jeff Sessions, according to this summary, how could you let this happen, Jeff? You were supposed to protect me. And then, according to this summary from Robert Mueller, he said to people in the room, everyone tells me if you get one of these independent counsels, it ruins your presidency. It takes years and years, and I won't be able to do anything. This is the worst thing that ever happened to me. Close quote, according to the Mueller report. The president then told Sessions, according to the report, that he should resign as attorney general. And in fact, according to the investigation, Jeff Sessions did submit a letter of resignation, but that was never accepted by the president. Now, the report goes on to say that at one point, there were press reports that then White House counsel Don McGahn was directed to fire the special counsel Robert Mueller, and that the president urged White House officials to tell McGahn to deny this. But according to what was said the, uh, in this report, uh, McGahn said he wouldn't do that and said McGahn told officials in that, uh, that the media reports were accurate in stating that the president had directed McGahn to have the special counsel removed. And of course, obviously that never happened. Now, uh, let me just give you some overall, uh, step back from that dramatic thing a little bit and give you some overall sense of uh, how the special counsel uh, report is um, is put together. I'm going to uh, direct you to, there. it's in two volumes, and we've been handed these two volumes in three ring binders. And I think one question that people may have is how heavily redacted is the report? Section two, which deals with the uh, investigations of potential obstruction of justice, as you can see, is very lightly redacted. But the other three ring binder that we've been given, section one, does have more extensive redactions. Here example is a, a page of what one of these pages looks like. So the, uh, the, the section one part about the investigation of Russian meddling into the election has more redactions and they relate to, in many cases, harm, they say harm to an ongoing matter. As you may recall, this is one of the categories that uh, Attorney General William Barr had said would be used to uh, to redact some of the uh, report that is going to the public. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.